Welp, my Azure video aged terribly. This is just going to be a quick update about what actually happened to Azure now that it's off of PTS and is easily tested with larger groups. The main reason the Azure Play change went under the radar for so long was because testing with a larger group is very hard on PTS as not many people install it. The major question to come out recently is was Azure actually nerfed or not? The short answer is technically yes it still was nerfed, however the long answer is it's not as easy as people thought it was. After Azure got off of the PTS, it was discovered very quickly that it seemed to do a lot more damage than it should be doing, and this is because of one of two things. It is bugged, I think, and also it works in a different way than people thought. When testing on the PTS, it was under the assumption that the one second cooldown was global for everyone using it, so you couldn't actually get more than this. However, this isn't true. The one second cooldown is per person per set. Whereas before, Azure was on a 0.5 second cooldown, meaning you could only get two Azure procs a second. The knock-on effect of this is, the more Azures you have in group, the faster Azure will detonate, and it can actually end up detonating faster than it could before. I really quickly want to explain how the new Azure works, as it's a little bit different than you're probably expecting. Azure Blight gives its tick to the last player who hits the target with top damage. This is just from one person's testing, so if you get a different result from this, let me know as I can't 100% say this is the only way it works, but the way we were testing it, this is how it worked for us. This just means with enough people, you can have Azure going off as fast or if not faster than last patch. At the end of the day, this basically means Azure Blight on one target is worse than it was before. However, due to a bug on more than one target, Azure Blight could probably destroy anything done last patch. Before going on about what this is about, I really quickly want to say that I do not know 100% how this works and what is causing it. With one target, it happens sometimes, with two it seems to be guaranteed, but yeah. On any amounts of targets though, if it's above one, it happens more frequently. Everyone who helped build a stack has a chance to get that Azure proc at the same time. You could end up with multiple Azures going off instantly. The reason I say on multiple targets it happens more frequently, it seems like if you match the number of Azures to the amount of targets, you get this bug to happen consistently. However, we did find on one target it is possible to get upwards of double and triple ticks on the target. This effectively allows Azure to do anywhere from 3 to 6 ticks a second, being way more than it was last patch. The overall damage nerf for this, however, makes it so that this isn't as effective as it would be on one target, but the second you start adding 2 to 3 targets in and you're getting 6 to 7 procs a second, this becomes extremely powerful very quickly. I can almost guarantee that this is a bug and will be fixed eventually, however for now it means Azure Blight is taking far more frequently than it should be. Overall though, I just wanted to make a quick update on this as Azure was acting very weirdly in some of my runs earlier this week with the new patch. We did end up testing it and finding some strange things with the double ticking and triple ticking, however this is probably going to get patched, but I hope the cooldown doesn't as it makes Azure a lot more viable and a lot more interesting to use. The only issue with this, and I say issue very lightly, is with the new Azure cooldown, it kind of just enforces the playstyle of putting all of your DPS in Azure Blight and not really thinking about anything else. But that's about all. I would say Azure is either on par with its old self or even better than it used to be. This makes me think it'll get nerfed, but we'll see how it goes. And I hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching.